<clears throat> so mandala means, um, what do you say? I translate mandala is as a the dimension, but mandala tilkur also means taking the essence, you know. Mm -hmm. So this mandala is uh, the symbol of the essence of our life. Mm -hmm. uh, our life as uh, humans, our spiritual aspect and our health and astrology about time and space and living environment. So mm -hmm. it's, it's a really like a complete system. So this is the Sutra part. And then we have the Tantric Mandala. So actually Tantric Mandala, we have one uh, behind your wall. Yes, that I can just Chakra. lean out of the way and you can see it. Uh, Kala Chakra. Mm -hmm. Is that Kala Chakra Mandala? Yes, that is the Kala Chakra Mandala painting of the Kala Chakra Mandala. So this uh, uh, Kala Chakra Mandala, of course, it's a Tantric Mandala. Um, yes, that's a Kala Chakra Mandala, which has the three buildings, body, speech, and mind. Yeah. And then uh, around in the circle of letters, there are all the stars and the lunar mansions and the days of the month and so forth. And um, so, and the, it's funny, I was just thinking the front face of the Kala Chakra is the same color, very dark blue black, as the Medicine Buddha's body, indicating this. Uh, healing energy and uh, but of course Kala Chakra is a has other faces and so on but but he has that healing medicine put a front face and the main torso is a sort of dark blue color also same as medicine Buddha so, so that, that's tantric one yes get on in the circle itself we can find the five elements you know the space space element wind element fire element water element and earth element Mm -hmm. So that's why normally the tantric mandala actually is representing the five elements, you know. So the five elements are connected also, uh, how do you say, with our human body. So we believe in tantric system, everything is created by five elements, right? Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. The universe is a creation of five elements and all sentient beings who are living in this universe, we are also made of five elements. Right. So how... We are all connected, you know, through the thread of the five elements. We have the mm -hmm. same thing there. Mm -hmm. and then when we say mandala is like taking the essence, you know, what is really like our essence. So our mm -hmm. essence. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. But then when we don't recognize the nature of those five elements, the five mm -hmm. elements are manifesting as the physical dimension. And also five elements are the base of five mental poisons. Mm -hmm. uh, which are ignorance, attachment, anger, pride, and jealousy. Mm -hmm. uh, also five inner poisons, they give birth to many other mental afflictions. So that's mm -hmm. why our essence is about five elements. But if we see the essence of the five elements, mm -hmm. then instead of seeing the five mental poisons, <laughs> five types of uh, wisdom. Mm -hmm. So normally the tantric mandala is one center and four directions, right? Four directions, one center, so five of them. And then mm -hmm. in our human body, so we can find in our five chakras, you know. Uh -huh. so they are lined up, you know, in the head chakra, throat, the heart, and navel, and uh, base chakra. But when when we see mandala, one center, four direction, the center is the heart, and mm -hmm. then the navel goes to the right side. And then the uh, throat goes to the left side, mm -hmm. and then here we have the uh, the water, and then here we have the wind. So that's mm -hmm. why in the center we have the in the center we have the space, uh, space, and then here we have the earth. Here mm -hmm. we have the water. Here is the fire, and down is the wind. Uh -huh. Repre representation of the the mandala, the tantric mandala. Uh huh. Okay. So according to Medicine Buddha's Tantric Mandala, uh, the main teachings are coming from Yuto Ninti, so Yuto, the heart teaching. Uh -huh. so Yuto Ninti, we can call it the Medicine Buddha's Anuttara Yoga Tantra. Uh -huh. Ane, so, mm -hmm. Chakra is Anuttara Yoga Tantra too. Mm -hmm. So therefore, in the Yuto Ninti, it gives the, 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 the perfect systematic explanation about the 
Medicine Buddha's mandala and how this Medicine Buddha's mandala we can discover in our human Vajra body. Uh -huh. That's the tantric mandala. So we talked uh -huh. about Sutra mandala and tantric mandala. And uh -huh. We go to into the medicine mandala. Uh -huh. And so medicine, uh, medicine mandala, the one we have here, the image. And can we see that image in a- Yes, can, I think it's there. Screen. It's the, it's there there oh no the the other one. This is the, the sutra mandala. Yeah, that's the that's the sutra mandala, and then we want the one that's up here on this uh, fourth thing. <clears throat> there, that one. That's right. So that's the garden, and the man, mandala of medicine and city actually. Yeah, yeah. It's a so city. We call it the Tana Duk. Right. So, yes. Right. Mm -hmm. so, Tanaduk Tung Cher means the city of the Tanaduk or city of mm -hmm. the Buddha. So in Tibetan tradition, we believe that uh, in the east direction, there is the paradise of medicine Buddha. Or the mm -hmm. land of uh -huh. The land is called the Tanaduk. For Tibetan <clears throat> medicine doctors, you know, we believe that if we are good doctors, then when uh, when we will die after death, we will, you know, take a rebirth into the medicine Buddha's pure land. So I'm, <laughs> I'm, joking, I'm joking. That's where we, we retire, you know. <laughs> when we it's a very good retirement. But this is the thing, Ella, on this outside the wall, outside the wall of the palace, there are all these little buildings. It's hard to see in this... Uh, in this uh, picture, but, on the, but you have, oh good, you can see. There are all those little buildings there. No, no, don't go so far. Outside, right, right on the white, ever, right. like that's a good direction. So just those little buildings there. So yeah, that's where you retire again, like you get, they get the good doctors retirement homes are in this circle of buildings, right? Oh, nice. Yes, yes. That's for the good doctors, good nurses, good medical professions, <laughs> our next life. <laughs> so That's wonderful. Is, and they have, a when they look inside to the center, they see the palace of medicine Buddha, which the that. walls are transparent, actually, they, so they can see through. It's like a glass uh, jewel wall. And then they look outside, they see all the wonderful plants and the beautiful things in the garden of nature, right? Yeah. Yes, yes. And then in Tibetan medicine, we have this uh, Tanadu. Actually, when we, uh, you know, Tibetan medicine, we call it the Sowa Rigpa. Uh -huh. By the healing signs. But uh -huh. I'm the Sowa Rigpa as a signs of health and the happiness. Uh -huh. And of course, the medical sciences are talking about health, but also Sowa Rigpa is very much focusing about uh, happiness. Uh -huh. so Translating, you know, Swarigpa as a signs of health and happiness. Uh -huh. When we study the Swarigpa, actually, we have a very famous textbook. It's called the Four Tantras. Mm -hmm. When when we study the first tantra, it's called the Root Tantra. The first chapter is about this uh, Tanatha. Uh -huh. It's very nice. Uh, you know, when we start to study Tibetan medicine. In the beginning, like we kind of enter in this mandala. Actually, this medicine uh, mandala, it's like a botanic garden. It's like a botanic garden. You know, you enter in this botanic garden. So that's why around this palace, you know, you see so many trees and flowers and rocks and, uh, you know, mineral water and so on. So those mm -hmm. are representing the 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 medicines you know medicinal substances in the nature and uh, so that's why we can call it this tanadu as a um, botanic garden mm -hmm. uh, then inside <clears throat> yeah there's a wall and four directions mm -hmm. and four gates and each gate they're like uh, the protectors you know those are the buddhist uh, four kings from each direction one is from east and one is south, one is uh, west, and one is the north. Mm -hmm. 